Hi, uh, welcome to mytoolkit.co.uk. If you've visited us before, well, welcome again. If you haven't, my name's Steve, and I'm going to go through today an 18 gauge brad nailer. Now, we do have a smaller brad nailer on the range, but this one goes up to a leg length of 50 mil. Come over to the bench and I'll show you the tool. As you can see, it comes in its own carrying case. That's the tool in question. Nice, neat travel case whether you're going off-site or working in the workshop. And there's many features on this tool. As I say, 18 gauge. The lovely thing with the 18 gauge, it's probably the most universal used pin in the wood workshop. And here we've got, I'll bring it closer to the camera, there's a rubber tip there. It stops bruising on soft woods and a spring-loaded anti-jam. Remove from the airline if you do get a jam and then it can be cleaned up and you're back in action. There's no fiddly bolts, bolts, allen screws, etc. Magazine, as you can see, opens up, loads the fasteners, and again, like features on many of these tools, there is a wheel there which adjusts the depth of drive. We can move one way and it moves the safety out, move it the other, retracts the safety. And what that does, that adjusts the depth of penetration of the pin through the work surface so you can have it just below which would be ideal for sort of wood filling afterwards or paint etc to give that nice smooth finish now just to show you this tool it's got um, adjustable exhaust and unlike its smaller version it's slightly heavier at 1.2 kilograms but nice and light and versatile the tool below this, the 32mm brad nailer, is 1.1 kilograms. So there's very little in that. And just show you how to load. Again, undo the magazine. What I've got here is an 18 gauge 30mm brad. But as I said, this tool will go up to 50mm, 2 inch in leg length, from a size of 20mm. And it's a pin with a very slight head. If you want to know more about fastenings, we will be doing a video and it'll go through the various staples and nails, etc. Place into the tool. As you can see, nice smooth movement there. Close up the magazine and we're ready to go. Connect to the airline. Here we've got some soft timber. And as I say, it could be oak, MDF, various woods. And if I just place that on top, the safety has to be depressed before firing. As you can see, when not in contact with the work surface, it will not fire. And there we go, 30mm pin through the timber, fixing those two. As you can see, how fast it can be applied and there's a good solid fixing now whether it be timber on timber or we want to do beading as you can see fine beading there maybe glued and then we can go we can fire those pins and there we've got it a nice firm fixing now just connect this tool from the other line there's numerous applications. I can go on and on and on. Uh, beading for picture frames, mirror frames, boat building of course, shop fitting and display, door frames and skirting, and as a lot of uh, joiners will tell you, second fixed joinery. Fire surrounds, furniture, cabinet making, general woodwork, kitchens, bedroom furniture, pet runs, cages, enclosures, Sheds and garden buildings, of course. Tongue and groove, saunas, flooring. I can go on and on and on. But, as you can see, a very, very versatile tool. Purchase it on the website, mytoolkit.co.uk and we'd like to see you again soon. So take care. Bye.